Talk to Jay. Just finished watching Night the Poet versus Elijah Street. Crucible Phase 2. Hmm. Huh. Let's let's get into the battle. Um first round, Night the Poet was rapping. Then he choked toward that. Um Elijah Street was rapping really good. He's a really good puncher. Um, round two, Knight mentioned about the saga cosine, which we knew that was going to be brought up. Um, dog, his round was, Knight's round was super short. He jersey his second round. He only rapped probably like three balls. Terrible. Terrible. <laughs> Um, it was short, like, like his preparation was terrible for, for this. Elijah Stray was rapping good. He just got a slow down that he doesn't stumble. That he doesn't stumble. Like, stumble on his words and stuff. Um, round three, Night the Poet started off around with some I'm not even going to repeat the balls. But how Aesami said, I beg your pardon. That's all I'm going to say. If you watch the battle, you watch the recap afterwards, you know <laughs> what Anwar repeated was the balls. That was terrible. I, he definitely needs to run his balls by somebody. Um, He needs to work on preparation. And memorization of his bars. Because he had bars. But you can tell he was forgetting things. And he got to slow down too. Slow down so we can hear what you're saying. Um, Elijah. Just got to work on breath control. Slowing down. And just um, overall being clean. But this definitely was an easy one for Elijah straight. I don't agree with Anwar saying that Elijah Street will be like a Av or or a Rom in like three to four years. Or I'm um, alluding to that. I don't agree with that. I think let Elijah Street continue to battle. He's a great puncher. And let him build himself up to like that point. Like, it's too early to compare him to a ROM or, or an AF. But I definitely see great things for Elijah Street in his future, though.